Hey, what's going on, guys? It is Blue here. Um, first off, I'm just gonna apologize for my inactiveness, guys. Basically, my computer took a shit on itself. Um, to further explain, there. Um, basically, um, let's say one day you get on your computer and um, you get on Skype, you start talking with your friends, and um, your computer just decides to blue screen randomly. And, um, what you can see in that blue screen mostly is something about, um, your memory, or whatever, but, you know, when you blue screen, you're, you're kind of panicking, and the screen doesn't actually stay there for you to look at for a long time. It just comes and goes, and you're kind of left there just like, what the fuck just happened? So, then you reboot your computer, and, um, most of the time, when you first blue screen, if this is your first time as it was mine... Um, everything is fine, you know, nothing really damages, nothing damaging happens to your computer. But, um, you know, you still have that feeling like, what the hell just happened, and you saw maybe something about memory, but not really because the screen was only there for like a millisecond. So, yeah, um, basically, um, after that, as I said, usually your computer is fine after your first blue screen. Hopefully your computer would be fine, but, um... Mine wasn't in this particular case. I was not sure why, so I took it upon myself to basically. Oh man, I was going ham right there. But what I did basically was um, I basically popped in my Windows 7 install DVD and went through the install and formatted both my SSD and my hard drive. So basically, Windows was not installed on anything at this point. And I'm ba I was basically just going to reinstall Windows 7 Ultimate on um, my SSD, which is basically what I did before, but I was just redoing it, just to see if it would fix any problems. So let's say you're 60% through this process of installing Windows 7, and your computer blue screens. And this time, your comp like um, the blue screen stays there for like a while, like it doesn't go away until you actually manually shut down your PC. And you see something there about memory. You're always seeing memory. And this is basically what happened to me. Um, every time I would try to install Windows 7, I would blue screen and see something sudden or subtle about memory. And I just died there, but um, I'm going to continue to start before I switch off to the new round. So basically, um, a day went by just me constantly stressing, just trying to install this, and it constantly blue screening at different points of the installation. Sometimes it was at 67%, sometimes it was at 30 Then I decided to get on Tom's har hardware and, um, you know, check if anybody else had this problem. And um, I also mentioned in my post that it said something about memory. So what this guy, just, um, he suggested for me to do is take out um, one of the dims of memory. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but I have 8 gigs total, or had 8 gigs total. It was 4 by 2 two dims. There's 4 gigs on each. So I basically took out the one in the second um, the second slot. It was recommended to take that one out and keep the one in the first slot in. So that's what I did, and um, I tried to reinstall Windows 7, and everything was nice and dandy. So I'm guessing that memory dim got corrupt in some way. So basically, um, yeah, I've been basically stressing over that for the past two days, just trying to, you know, um, get content out for you guys. And... Um, now I'm back, of course, but there are probably going to be some mishaps in my daily upload plan. I'm going to try to get over here where it's not too laggy. Whoa. Never mind, it's just a hole. I'm jumping. But yeah, basically, um, the computer is actually working now. As you can see, I'm playing on it. But it's only running off 4 gigabytes of RAM, so sorry if you see some stuttery gameplay here. What are you doing, man? But yeah, um... 4 GB of RAM, as you can see, if I hit F3, um, yeah, all the way to the right, it's only 4, um, well, it doesn't show it there, but yeah, I only have 4 GB of RAM at the moment, um, what I'm thinking of doing is sending the, um, the whole RAM kit into, in for RMA, and get, um, two fresh new ones, and hopefully I'll be good with those, but yeah, basically, one of my dims is corrupt, everything was fine after I took out that second dim, um, I'm, as I said, I'm only left with 4 gigabytes, but you know, I can still run games fairly fast. Okay guys, we are back in a new round. This is the smaller map, finally I can get some gameplay on it. But yeah, after explaining that whole story, hopefully you guys can realize, um, how stressful these last few days have been. 
um, with this whole computer situation. But yeah, um, it's actually working now. So yeah, um, for the next few gameplays, sorry if it's a bit stuttery. I only have four gigabytes of RAM, as said before. I'm not too sure when I'm gonna do the RMA. But um, on on other news, maybe the gameplay won't be that stuttery in the next week, cause today, in fact, the day I'm recording this. Um, I'm not too sure what today's date, I, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Wednesday, I don't know the actual dates, but, um, I ordered my graphics card, so, um, it's basically, it's, it's a different pick what I was gonna originally go for, and, um, it turns out I got the better deal, as this graphics card is better than the original one I was gonna buy, and, um, it was for the same price, it's, so, yeah, um, it's basically a 760, the Gigabyte 760, um, it has the Wind Force Cooler, which is basically the three, um, three, uh, the three fan cooler. Um, all the links will be in the description. Um, if you want to check out my PC specs on my channel, just go to the About tab. I listed everything there. Uh, there are no links there, but you can basically Google what's from there and find what I got, basically. So yeah, um, that should be coming in in the next week. It is, um, I ordered it today and it, it already, ha sorry guys, I cannot talk. It already shipped. So that should come in fairly quick as I live in the States. So, you know, I don't really have to wait that long for shipping. But yeah, um, I'm just going to do a few rounds here. Sorry, I haven't been focusing on the gameplay. That was a really big update. But yeah. So, as I said before, very stressful uh, past few days. Alright guys, we're back in a new round, of course, um, the smaller map again. Yeah, but as I left off before, before I got cut off by that um, round ending, basically, um, it's been a very stressful few days. Um, I'm actually, I'm, you know, I'm glad the computer's actually running and it wasn't any of the, um, it wasn't anything like the motherboard that was messed up or anything, you know, it wasn't the, um, the hard drives. Oh, and another thing that was, that was freaking me out once I actually got Windows 7 installed, after I took out the, the, the one dim. Um, after everything was nice and dandy, um, when I actually booted into Windows, I went to, you know, my computer, and my one terabyte hard drive was not showing. Only my SSD was, which is basically my boot drive. But um, the one terabyte, it was rec it was being recognized in the BIOS, it, but it was not coming up in my computer on the Windows 7. You know, when you go to my computer, it shows all your stuff there. But yeah, that it wasn't coming up there, so I was freaking out because it came up in the BIOS, but it didn't come up in um actual my computer for some reason. I I have no idea why. But um, I went to the disk management and it was showing up there, so I was like really like stumped and confused and when I actually saw the one terabyte volume or drive it, it wasn't labeled as anything it was just blank like that as far as the name went so what I had to do was label it and everything was fine the second I labeled it to a to um a letter it showed up in my computer fine right after that immediately right after that and Windows 7 should do that automatically, I shouldn't have to do that manually, you know. So, um, nothing was wrong there except for that little fault in, um, the Windows 7 installation. But yeah, everything is fine now, as you can see. Um, as I said before, sorry if the gameplay is a bit stuttery. But, you know, that's all you can really do for now. So, I only have 4 gigabytes of RAM, as I explained before. But yeah, guys, um... Still pretty fun. I'm still gonna bring daily content. Like I said, if you see me slip up, I'm probably actually doing something on the computer. Um, when the graphics card comes in, I will be doing a um, a unboxing video and install video. Oh, I think I'm gonna win. I probably jinxed myself there. But yeah, I'm actually gonna um unbox it for you guys and install it on camera. I have a tripod for my camera now, so you know it's actually kind of easy to do this stuff now. So yeah, I'm definitely going to do that, and while I do that, I'm probably just going to show off my computer a bit. Um, very nice uh, graphics card that I got for the price. Very cheap. Whoa, okay. We're not. We're going to win. We're going to win. I think we can do this. Oh my god, come on! Where was he? You kidding right, me? Guys, we were back in the last round. Um, yeah, so basically after all that, um... As as you can see, I'm playing on it. As I said before, the computer is fine as of now. Um, 
it's not up to standard of what I purchased um, as far as my 8 gigs. It's only on 4 now. Because one of them um, is basically corrupt and does not work anymore. But, um, yeah, everything else is fine. As I said, the graphics card is coming in soon. And that guy had, like, a speed potion of some sort. Graphics card will be coming in in a week's time, sort of around that. As I said uh, before, I ordered it today, and it says it's shipped out already. So that's that's amazing. You know, the sooner the better. So, yeah, um, on other news, some other games that I'm, I will be recording and playing with uh, my buddies, Rebug and Zico, and, uh, you know, the crew, Hammy, um, some Payday, definitely, some Darkness, too. Um, of course Minecraft, you know. Um, I have some other games, Gary's Mod, that I can probably record better. I can record it fine now, but, um, you know, that graphics card really help. It's gonna help insanely with, um, just, you know, the actual gameplay side, because I can actually record the game, it's just, you know, having those extra FPS really helps when you're playing. So, yeah, um... Also, interested in getting Battlefield 4. I know that comes out way in October, but that's around my birthday, so I'm definitely going to have money for that. Um, I might buy Battlefield 3 in the next week, just so I can um I can start playing that. I'm probably going to buy it um, before the graphics card comes in, just so I have it ready, and once it comes in, I can start you know getting gameplay and stuff. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm always open to collaborations if you guys want to message me and do something. Um, together on YouTube as far as gameplay goes, and, um, you know. But yeah, I'm definitely into buying some more games to play for you guys. Grand Theft Auto 4, I'm actually gonna start my, um, my playthrough of that once the graphics card comes in. I kinda waited, um, for my graphics card to come in. Definitely for that game. Um, Skyrim is also gonna continue. Everything's basically gonna get on the roll once the graphics card comes in. And also, um, you know, once I have the graphics card, I'll definitely be, um, you know, as I said, I'll be running games more smoothly. And then in the future, I can always get the RAM done as far as the sending that in and then getting it replaced. Or maybe I'll just buy, like, a whole new kit. I'm not sure. But yeah, that's basically it, guys. Thank you for watching. I know it's been a lot of talking, huge updates. Once again, sorry for the inactiveness. It's not really my fault. Just my computer being literally broken. Just was not working at all. Thank you guys for watching. I know it's been a lot of talking here, but you know, um, very important information and updates on why I haven't been uploading daily, which I can easily do. But with all this stuff that just came up, it's been really difficult, really stressful. But yeah, it's basically guys. Thank you for watching. It has been Blue here, and I'm out.